Happy Monday morning, men. I hope that you're doing well. You know, uh, one of my favorite verses in Proverbs is chapter 4, verse 23. It says, keep your heart with all diligence, for from it flows the issues of life. And the interesting thing about that word uh, heart there in the Old Testament, it's luv. And it's translated actually in the New Testament as mind. And so what we see is they kind of saw them as interchangeable. You know, to guard our heart is it, kind of weird, you know. That's, that's more like our physical diet, right? You know, that's a blood pumping organ. But if all of a sudden somebody says, guard your mind, for out of it flows the issues of life. Well, that makes a little bit more sense. Why? Because what goes in is ultimately what comes out. That's what Jesus taught us. It's not the food that we eat that passes through the body and is expelled that's the problem. It's what's already in there that comes up, or as I've said before, what's in the well will always come up in the bucket. And so uh, I want to ask you this question on this Monday morning. How are you doing at Garden Your Mind? Are you allowing things through TV, through social media, through music, through what, a lot of other means? Are you allowing it to influence you closer to Christ or is it taking you further from Christ? Because remember, what we allow in is what's going to come out. So whatever's coming out, let's make sure that it's a sweet, pleasing aroma that pleases our Lord and Savior. I hope you have a great week. I'll see you next Monday.